I don't wear very much makeup. So the fact I'm doing this is just because I love the god. Yes. Also, don't mind me talking like a lobotomy patient because I have gum in my mouth. And uh, my mouth is not used to um, things being in it when I'm talking. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm making an altar for Aphrodite, um, Lady Aphrodite, or uh, Lady Venus, as some people call her. I just say Lady Aphrodite because I'm more Hellenic, Greek Hellenic than Roman. But um, either is fine. I don't think she minds they're the same deity after all. I have, I have stuff right up here. By the way, I have their photos up here as well. This is not only going to be an altar for Aphrodite, but also Ares and all the other gods that I worship. So I want to show off what I have. So I have these little rose, like fake roses, because I just do. I'm going to be putting them on my bed while I'm talking. And then earlier, I made these little um, rose and gold earrings for her. Um, these I made a really long time ago. Well, not a really long time ago. The beginning of the month. These, like, little, like, kiss, like, kiss prints of my lips. And I gave her, like, a little more pastel pink rose. Um... Here's this. I made this from a Harry Potter thing, which is ironic because I'm queer. <laughs> and also trans. So, you know. And also fuck J.K. Rowling. Anyway, I digress. And I got her some makeup. I don't really use this lipstick anymore. And it was on sale, so that's hers now. Also because I just don't really like wearing pink very much. Um, I have... Some uh, rose quart. Rose quart. Um, I have some pendulums. Oh wait, another rose quart, sorry. Rose quart. I have my pendulums, which I'm going to be using. That's not only for their altar. Um, some fake lavender, um, that I got from Target a while ago. Um, I have some green jasper and a venturine green, which will just really bring, like, good luck and such. And then, last thing I have is... This little love potion I have for my partner and I, which I did that in an ethical way, please. Don't even come in my comments saying shit. And then I have this as their little um, mat for their altar. So what I'm gonna do first, it, oh wait, yeah, I also have a smaller version of the love potion. Um, I'm also gonna be offering this, which is a little statue I made of Aries in modeling clay, not modeling clay, air dry clay. I'm going to be doing Aphrodite soon, so stay tuned for that. <laughs> um, I'm also going to be burning an incense in just a second. Um, also, we'll be adding this tea I don't really like, but it might be really good for her. It's just not my type of tea personally. So firstly, I'm going to lay down the mat. And this could be just like a guide, mostly. If you want this to be a guide, this is a guide for you. Oh, fuck. I'm going to fold it just a little bit. I'm just going to fold it in half, just a bit. Um, then I should put the deities photos up. This is 
um, fuck, sorry, Apollo and Hyacinth. Put that up here. And then this is Aries and uh, Aphrodite. And they are going to sit very nicely here. Then what I do want to add is their statue first. And I will be placing that right there. By the way, I do not have a statue statue for um, any of my gods. The only thing I kind of remotely have to that is this. Hold on. Is this. And it's a unicorn that I got. Because my younger, my older cousin, my older cousin didn't want it anymore. And I might paint it one day, but I do like it. It's just iridescent. Her hooves are a little bit fucked up. That's okay. It's porcelain. And hopefully soon I will be getting a little statue to put on their altar. But for now, I am not. So firstly, what I want to do is give my offerings to Aphrodite. And since I cannot burn an incense at the moment because my lighter doesn't work, I will just, I will, I will do that later. Um, I cannot also light a candle. This is the candle I would give to her. I'm getting a new candle later soon. But first, if I want to cleanse it, I'm going to give them some uh, rose water and vanilla. This also has some essential oils in it, so be careful um, where you put it. And just, I'm just gently boiling some. I had made this rose water about a year ago, but it's very good for. It's pretty good. Um, and I just let that dry down really and then when I'm ready um, I will put my little potions up give this a nice good couple shakes putting that right next to my statue and then this one is just a tinier version of the other one, but it has hair in it because I cut some hair off. It has black for Aries. It's stamped down a little bit just so that it pours a little bit over. This, like I said, I got from a Harry Potter kit, but it looks enough like for Aphrodite. And then I will place it neatly. Oh my god, neatly. This also is for Apollo. It's a little... And Hermes, by the way. Apollo and Hermes. It's a little turtle with bandages and a little stethoscope. stethoscope. And that will be going right here. Let's hope my cat does not take any of the shit I put on here. Then I will start adding the crystals around the... By the way, I am able to take off these crystals and go and charge them in the sunlight in the window. That doesn't change anything. These are mainly my offerings to them. But I will offer more things as I go along. Sorry, I thought I saw someone talk look at like looking in my window. It's not. By the way, I have a little sunlight pendum pendulum pendant that I will be putting on there's people walking by. Never mind. 
Go away, bitch. Oh, never mind. They're leaving. Um, the Jasper and the Aventurine Green will be going right near Apollo. And yeah. I will be put scattering my kiss marks all around the altar just to know that they are loved, that I love them so very much. Oh shit! Uh, that would that probably looked poetic as shit, but it was not in real life. Um, I want to attract love in my life again, like with my lover and such. We're not going. We're not. I don't know if, how we're doing right now, but I'm hoping we're doing good. I won't know until a few more days, and it's fucking agonizing. Um. This is some more rose water. It just has no, it just doesn't have anything else in it. I also have this rose water that is, this has more of the petals and such in the water. And it's a little bit older. Like it was, it, it had more time to oxygenate. And it just has like petals and such and just stem. Which, if you want a more nature-y look for it, I mean, I guess. I'm, I am I do like to add, like, a little bit of every rose water I have. Just so they know. This is for them. Then I do like to spray just the rose water onto the back of my kiss marks. Let those set in. By the way, this does stink of al almonds, so please be careful when you're spraying any of this shit, like any of the rose water, especially if you don't add anything to it. It's going to smell heavily. Of, it's going to smell really bad. But... It is what it is, basically. And then when I bless it, I will bring my pendulum out. Um, I'm also going to add my lipstick right now, right near my potion and such, just so that it looks a lot more nicer. I will be adding photos of Dionysus onto this altar. I will be adding a little bit of everything that I worship. My hero altar is up here. Um, some of the gods and deities that I worship will be going up here. Um, just because either they are like they were patrons of those heroes, such as Odysseus and Tele Telemachus, uh, Achilles and Patroclus. So Poseidon might not go up here, but he might go on my. Uh, God altar. Athena will be going up here. Uh, Artemis will be going up down here. Dionysus will be going up here. Um, who else? Hermes. That's more bounce off. I will be putting two photos. One on my hero altar and one on my deity altar. But these are all my pendulums. Pendum. Pendulum. Yeah, pendulums. This one is amethyst. This one is onyx, I think. Yeah, this one is onyx. Blends a lot into my shirt. And this one is moonstone. And personally, how I want to do it with this one is I'm going to take this one since it's a lot more prettier. And more feminine, I guess. And I will be swinging it. Well, I will be centering it. I will make sure it's as still as possible. Um, 
Are you here with me, Aphrodite? I hope you accept these gifts and offerings. I think that's a yes. Apollo, I hope you also accept these gifts and I hope you know how much I absolutely love you guys and I worship you guys. Thank you for being, thank you for allowing me to present this all to you. I'm not even like moving my hand very much and it's going. By the way, um, I will be adding my playlist of things into the description of this that um, kind of helps with guided meditation into connecting. I will also be putting my Hellenic studies into this because I do know that a lot of people do not, you know, quite understand how to really get into that. But if I can help any, I will. And I guess for a final reveal... Um, that is what my altar looks like for them. That is what my altar looks like for them, for my heroes. You cannot see all of them, but that is okay. I hope you all enjoyed this, and I and happy blessings. See you all. Thank you so much for listening, and thank you so much for watching. Love you all so much. Thank you, Aphrodite, for allowing me to make you a...